I can remember as a young girl waiting for our vacation where we would go to the shore. I'd run through the hot sand and put my toes into the water and let the waves caress my feet. And the life was wonderful. I had no cares. I had no worries. I really just had a wonderful life. I was free to be me. And I had dreams of what I would be when I grow up. Time had no meaning for me. It would go on forever and ever. That's what I thought anyway. But I have since realized, as I've gotten older and wiser, don't wait for things to get easier, simpler or better. Life will always be complicated. Just learn to be happy right now. Otherwise, you just may run out of time. Make a vow to yourself right now to, to live your dream, to do all of those things in your life that you wanted to do. Don't wait, because people who wait on the plains of hesitation, lay down, and that's it. Welcome, it's Sandra Hart with Life Over 60. Thank you so much for joining me today. When I was a young girl, and you probably too, we never thought about wrinkles. We never thought about how the sun was going to damage our skin, so we went out and got beautiful tans every summer. Old age seems so far away, and wrinkles seem so far away. Well, now the scientists have been able to put wrinkles, whoopee, in five different categories. So I thought today I would talk about the different types of wrinkles we have and what solutions that we can do that are inexpensive to help soften our wrinkles. The five types of wrinkles are gravitational, elastic, Toic, compression, atrophic, and expression. These are all different types of wrinkles that we have. Now, the collagen, as we get older, starts to break down, and we don't have the elasticity in our skin as much as we used to do, as we used to have. So, there are things now that you can buy at your local drugstore or at Ulta, Target, Walgreens, it doesn't matter, that are inexpensive that can help fade and fight those wrinkles. You don't have to spend $500 a pop or $250 a pop in order to get these very simple ingredients in your skincare regimen. So let's go over them one by one. The first one is gravitational. Gravitational would be the smile lines here, the lines where your collagen is breaking down and starting to pull all of these things here. Hyaluronic acid is what you can do to help soften those wrinkles. Go to the drugstore and any product that you can find that has hyaluronic acid in it would be a solution to taking care of these lines. One thing I know would be the Olay Advanced Anti-Aging Cream. It has hyaluronic acid in it. 
but just read the labels and you'll find that there are a lot of products in your local drugstore that have this particular ingredient in them to help soften those gravitational lines. The elastotic is exactly what most of us are guilty of because when we were younger we went out in the sun and the sun breaks down the fiber in your skin and makes it thick and leathery looking. So the thing that you can use, the ingredient that you can buy in a simple product from the drugstore would be glycolic acid. The glycolic acid helps to repair and soften all of that damage in your skin. Just think of your skin as an elastic band that has lost some of that elasticity in your neck, uh, around your lips, your upper lip, and all of those areas where the sun has broken down the fibers in your skin. You can buy, in uh, many brands have the glycolic facial wipes or glycolic acid facial wipes that you can use in the morning or at night and that will help soften your lines. One of the products would be Nip Plus Fab Glycolic Facial Pads that you can put, but there are many products out there. But remember, you have to take a little time because you do have to read the labels to see what products are in your drugstore or your other retailer that would have the glycolic acid in it. The third one is for side sleepers. I mean, I usually sleep on my back uh, after I had my ablation. For some reason, I have been turning and sleeping on my side, and I do notice that some of the compression wrinkles I'm starting to get already. The compression wrinkles are when you sleep on the side and your face is compressed, and all of these wrinkles around here, you know, are there, you know, all the time that you are sleeping every night. So I would recommend, if possible, to sleep on your back. And if that's too uncomfortable and you just can't get used to that, do what I did. And I have a silk pillowcase. I also wear a silk cap at night to keep my hair from flying all over the place. But you will be amazed at if you do get a silk pillowcase that somehow it softens and, and your face doesn't really stick. It more or less glides and slides across the pillow so you won't have those deep compression marks if you cannot sleep on your back. Now we get to the next thing. And the next thing has to do with aging. Just aging. There's no way in getting around it. Our skin is getting older. Things are breaking down in our skin. It's just reality. There's nothing we can do about it. Our skin just breaks down. But what helps this would be using a product with peptides in it. Peptides help rebuild the collagen and slow down the aging process. There are many products, very expensive one. My, I have Chanel uh, Firming Cream. It has peptides in it. But I can also go to my drugstore, which I have done, and you can buy a product that has peptides in it. L'Oreal has an age perfect product that's probably only about $19 that does have peptides in it. So read the labels. I know it's a lot of work, but if you want to save money and get really good ingredients that you need for all of these five wrinkle, wrinkle treatments, you have to read your labels a little bit. And the last one would be expression wrinkles. I've said before, I didn't realize uh, when I started my YouTube channel how much I wrinkle my forehead. I have a very expressive forehead. I know my daughter does, and she's showing lines in her forehead. I don't know why, but I don't have lines in my forehead, and I really should have very deep lines in my forehead because I use my forehead a lot when I express myself. Your, your upper lip and around here, the smile lines, those all are expression 
lines and expression wrinkles. Garnier has a very good product that will help you with that. It's called Skin Activator Wrinkle Lift, I think. I think that's what it is. But also you can see that it does have retinol in it. Any product, Rock has a very good uh, wrinkle, uh, anti-wrinkle aging cream. Anything that you can find in your local retailer that would have retinol in it will help take away those expression lines. Now, you know, there's no 100% fix on anything. We're never, once a wrinkle is there, unless you have a facelift or unless you want to go the route of fillers, they're just not going to go away, but you really can soften them. And the way I'm feeling about expression lines and about the aging process, I, I really feel that, you know, it's who we are. And sometimes our expression lines and a little bit of aging is who we are. It's our character. I have seen women with facelifts that everything and Botox and they're just, their faces are motionless. They have no expression. They're too smooth. They almost look like they're wearing a mask. And, and maybe that's something you would like to consider. But for me, it, it's not the way I want to age. I don't want to be a wrinkled old bag, but I'll try to do everything I can to soften those lines but I know I'm not going to stop them. That's just part of the aging process, but whatever I can do to make my skin look better, I sure as heck am going to do it. That's for sure. So I'm going to put a uh, list below. Uh, after this video, there will be a list of all of the, the uh, ingredients that help take away or soften. They don't completely remove them. They soften your wrinkles and what ingredient helps each of the five different types of wrinkles. And I'm also going to put a link below to a video on facial massage. Now I do a facial massage every day. So by doing facial exercise, you're not, not only tightening the muscles, you start right here, I'll just give you a preview, you start right here with with these two fingers or these two fingers right here and you press and maybe count to 50 and then you move all the way up around here around your face up here around your eyes and I do it in the middle of my forehead then I work my way all the way down but if you practice this maybe at night before you go to bed or in the morning when you first wake up just sit on the edge of your bed and just meditate while you're doing it because you're not only helping your mind, you're helping your skin and you're relaxing and it's a good way to start the morning. So I am going to put that link below as I said. And I hope you found this video interesting. If you like it, give me a thumbs up if you would like. And I want you to subscribe if you're not a subscriber already. I love having you and remember Life is too short. Please be good to yourself. And I know you've got a lot of love in your heart, so spread it around. Have a great, great day, and I hope to see you soon.